Hi, it's Sylvie from Scout and I'd like to thank you for joining me for the training that I'm going to take you through uh, our foundations and our blush bronzer contour kit. So if you've got those range, because as you know, I broke up our makeup range and you can just range the particular ones that you want to have in. So we've got the foundation range, we've got the eye range, we've got the lip range, and we also have the uh, certified organic superfood skincare range. So let's focus on the foundations. So we have three types of foundations. We have our fluid foundation, our loose powder foundation, and our cream compact foundation. And a lot of people, I'm going to include some of the questions that I get asked. So um, one of the questions that comes through from a lot of stores uh, is, so I've got a lady that comes in and she is middle-aged and she's not sure she's, what sort of foundation she wants, but she's in the past, she's always used uh, fluid. She definitely doesn't want um, loose powder because she says that makes her look older. Uh, so what do, I, what do I offer her? So number one, our loose powder foundation does not make you look older. I wear it, my 88 year old mother wears it. Um, it's the way we mill our minerals that um, they actually enhance uh, your skin and make you look really beautiful. Um, so but that was the first thing. But I would, I would reach for the cream compact because if she's a mature lady, she might have um, some dry skin uh, she might uh, want a bit more coverage. Uh, she might be looking for something like a BB cream. And this is really our version of a BB cream. I've been digging out of there. Um, so this is our version of a BB cream. And it comes with uh, its own little, underneath, its own little uh, uh, sponge to apply it. And that's how you put it on, just with the sponge. So this is buildable. As well, so you would start with one layer and then you would put another layer on. This could also be used under the eyes first to just um, diminish uh, dark circles. And you can also use the loose powder foundation over the top. Um, now with the cream, uh, it is a bit more nourishing, which is exactly what she may be looking for. Um, I want to show you how you can color match. And this would work with the fluid, this would work with the loose powder and the um, cream. So another question is, so somebody comes in and I want to interact with them and talk to them about the makeup they may be looking for. So, you know, how can I do it? And I always say, ask them if they want you to color match them. So you just simply, whatever product, you know, sort of ask them, are you looking for a fluid, are you looking for a cream, or are you looking for, you know, a loose powder? What type of skin do you have? And we'll talk about that in a minute. But what I would do is reach for two colours. So say, okay, let's do it with the fluid foundation. I would pick two colours. And then I'd put them on my hand. So I just squish a little bit, pump a little bit out of each colour. Oops, I did a bit more much. Um, but anyway, then I would, hopefully there's enough light in the store, you can take them towards the window. And then I would simply put, put a line of one and a line of the other. I haven't got a mirror here, so I can't see what I'm doing, but um, close, to, close, close to each other. And you can probably see already which one is my color. And my color is camel. But what you would do is you would blend those in and you'll, and you'll see, you can see on their skin, it should match their neck. And again, the best idea is to do it um, in front of a mirror or walk them outside quickly. It's good, you get to have a chat while you're doing that as well. Um, so that's our cream. And anybody can use this. Um, it's perfect for anyone with normal skin. It's perfect for a mature skin. Um, it's 
perfect for someone that is wanting a little bit more coverage. And as I said, if I was going to a wedding or a function, I'd probably use this and I'd use the loose powder over the top just to seal, just to give it that lovely finish. Um, but you don't need to. Um, so let's go on to the fluid. So the fluid is for anyone, any skin type at all. And there are women and men that this is the one for them. They've used it all their life. This is what they want to use. Um, I often say to people, because we have the same colours in our fluid as we do in our cream, I say, look, you know, use the fluid through, through the warmer months and then swap in winter when our skin's a little bit drier, swap to the cream. Um, and that gives them a bit of an option as well. Some people really love to do that. Um, but if you've got someone that, no fluid is just for me, then this is the perfect one for you. This will give you a beautiful, um, it's, a, it's a light to medium coverage. Um, and it's buildable again. Uh, it will give you that dewy look. I've, I've actually got that on um, today, and I, I think I've got, um, I might have two, two like, because I do one pump and then put it on my face, and then I'll do another pump and put it on my face. Um, and I don't have powder over the top. However, you can again use the loose powder over the top. Um, so this is for, um, yeah, all skin types and even somebody with a sensitive skin. It won't clog your pores. We don't have any dimethicone in any of our foundations at all. So um, non-clogging. Uh, in fact, we have beautiful shea butter, which is collagen building in our cream um, compact and Yehova as well. Um, so with our loose powder let me show you the best way to to use this so unscrew it dip your brush and it can be you know any any brush you want to use but you know I use a kabuki dip it in dip it into the powder tap off the excess like that then use the lid to work it into the bristles of the brush this is really important um, because you don't want, especially if you've just put your moisturiser on, then I really recommend if you're just using the powder, just give it a minute because uh, you don't want the powder to grab, uh, the cream to grab onto the powder that you're putting on. And then you just apply it in a circular motion all over your face. You can even use this, um, for somebody who might have some blemishes, you can dip your uh, finger in there or a clean Q-tip and and just press it on on a blemish or on any redness you can just sort of press and blend um because it's great for a so who would I, who would i recommend this for so all skin types again but um normal skin obviously uh if somebody came in and said i've got a lot of blemishes i just want something to cover them um, this is the one I would reach for, the powder. Um, it will not clog your skin. Uh, it's antimicrobial, antibacterial, so it actually will help with healing a little bit. So perfect for a teenage skin, perfect for a starter kit for a young uh, teenage girl, um, anyone with any problem skin, uh, uh, rosacea, um, psoriasis I would um, eczema I would be recommending the loose powder foundation to start with um, and yeah so the next thing that is in the um, foundation um, option is our um, pure color blush bronzer contour palette and see it's got a lovely little sleeve so you can um, keeps it all together for traveling but anyway I'll pull it out they're very gorgeous um, and they come with a gorgeous mirror and four. So you've got your two blush, blush options up there and you also have a peach, very peach blush down here but you can also use that for contouring and of course you've got your bronzer here which you can use all over as a bronzer but also as a, if, for contouring. And I don't know if you um, have seen my uh, video that I did. I mean, I'm not a makeup artist, but I did my best <laughs> when I um, 
when I showed how you can contour to make your nose look slimmer, um, to hide your jowls, um, to accentuate your cheekbones. Uh, but basically, they're fantastic. It's a really great, um, a really great little option for that. And again, suits all skin all skin tones. So, because uh, you've got your pink, you've got your peach, and you've got your, like a berry kind of colour. And um, yeah, so I think I have um, sort of covered off everything. Oh, um, the loose powder is 20 plus SPF. It's gone through TGA, so it actually has 20 plus, but it is a secondary sun product. So you're not selling this to anybody that wants a sunscreen. This is a secondary sun product. Our cream compact and our fluid are 15 uh, plus, I think it's 15 plus, um, natural uh, sun protection. So um, there you have it. Stay tuned because I'm going to be taking you through the other ranges and you can uh, watch them in your own time. And of course, you can always call me or send me an email and I'm happy to answer uh, questions for you. Bye.